members of Project Cable Car Tramway Dunedin met with Suki Turner today, hoping to get the City Council on board. As Fiona McMillan reports, it's an idea with green appeal for Mayor Turner. Trams and cable cars rumbling their way around Dunedin streets could be a thing of the future if one group of enthusiasts gets its way. Don Myers and some of his Project Cable Car Tramway Dunedin group talked transport with the Mayor today, looking for support for their ambitious project. Well, one of the things that uh, we feel is important is to bring the north end of town closer to the centre and closer to the southern part of town. And we feel that a tram uh, with a loop system at one end would be an ideal way to begin this. And uh, I think the mayor agrees with our thoughts but feels we need to get some feasibility work done. So we're looking at the uh, financing of a feasibility study for a new, a new tram system in Dunedin. This may take some time. In fact, Don and his group will be happy if they can get trams back on our streets by 1999. They started working last September. But a new year and a new mayor meant it was time to seek council support. And Suki Turner has a personal interest in a tram's environmental advantages. Well, you know that I belong to the Green Party and uh, I'm very interested in the ecology of the city. Um, I'm interested in uh, the environment. The DCC may be able to help with money for the feasibility study. Once the tram fans win over city councillors, they'll be looking for funding and support from the wider community. Fiona Macmillan, News at 7. I think the cable cars will be magic for Dunedin. They'd look good, in fact. I think there's one in Christchurch. We should get it back. That's a really good idea. Well, coming up after the break, New Zealand's 